This is HurricaneSports.com. I'm in Yacht with Shane Larkin. First of all, happy Valentine's Day. It's Valentine's Day. So Shane, you know those little candy hearts with yeah. the, like one or two words on? So let's say you have a Valentine that you want to give your heart to, but you only got like one or two words to sell yourself. What, what would you put on the heart? To sell myself? Yeah. Um, uh, like characteristics about myself? Or just, like, <laughs> just a word. You get one shot to send um, a little candy heart over. <laughs> Miss you, I guess. Miss you? Uh, oh. <laughs> okay. All right, now let's talk about basketball. Right. Um, you've gotten into the starting position as a guard, which is awesome as a freshman. Yeah. Um, do you think a lot about the future because you are so young, or do you try to stay focused on the now? Um, well, you always think about the future. But, um, definitely thinking about the now. We have a great opportunity to make the NCAA tournament this year. And I know the last time we won it like three or four years, four or five years ago. So um, it's a great opportunity for the program and Coach L in his first season to make the tournament and just raise the excitement about our program, and I'm really looking forward to that. Okay, and going back to your freshman, because it's, it's really, it, you've only had a little window of time here, but some crazy good experiences. Can mm -hmm. you pick the most memorable moment for you? Definitely uh, last weekend being Duke at Duke. Cameron Indoor. Um, it's just a great experience. Uh, I know nobody on the team has ever beaten them, and I think it was our first win at Cameron. So uh, it was just a great experience, the excitement in the locker room after the game. I just, I'll never forget that. Okay, and we have some fan questions. Um, right. Brian Elliott wants to know, um, your dad Barry's a baseball guy, but do you think you can beat him in basketball? Oh, yeah, uh, my dad stopped playing me like five years ago in basketball. Um, he's always post me up because I was smaller than him, but now we're about the same height and he can't take me to the post anymore, so he won't play me anymore. Okay. And Zubair wants to know if you prefer to play in Jordans or LeBron UM with the colorway. <laughs> um, <laughs> you gotta think about that one, huh? Yeah, uh, um, I'm gonna go with the LeBrons. They're very comfortable, and he he gave them to us, so appreciate that. Um, <laughs> Thank you, LeBron. I'll say LeBrons. All right, and so looking ahead to tomorrow night, it's really exciting because um, you guys have changed a lot. I'd say since the last time you played North Carolina, but how would you say that is the most? Um, well, we've changed the lineup, we've changed the plays, uh, we've changed our offensive philosophy. We're trying to feed Reggie a lot more now after the Duke game. Uh, Y'all can see that uh, paid off. And um, uh, we're just going to play harder on defense and try to execute the game plan better than we have in the past. And hopefully it works out. Okay, awesome. Right. Well, make sure you guys tune in the game. Tip-offs at 8 p.m. tomorrow night against North Carolina right here in the Bank United Center. It is on ESPN. But if you can't get here, and you really got to try to get here, uh, follow us on Twitter at Hurricane Sports because we keep you pretty updated as the action unfolds. Thanks for joining us. Thank you. See you soon. All right.